So for this tuna sandwich, you're going to need, of course, a can of tuna, or you can buy regular tuna and chop it up. Uh, one white onion. I only prefer white onion for this sandwich. Uh, red tomato. And you're going to need some cilantro. Lettuce. And of course, bread. <laughs> I also forgot to mention that you're going to need a pickle and a bowl to put everything inside of. In this video, I'm not going to show you how I chopped them. I just chopped them all small. So it'll show you how I chop all of them. Like, see how they're all small. So yeah, that's what you're going to do. And then for the tomato, it's going to show you right now. But get a spoon and take out all the water, the seeds and everything, and then chop it real thin. And I only use a little tip of tomato because I'm not really a big fan. So now I have them all chopped up and that's how they should look inside the bowl before you put like tuna or anything in it. Then you're going to move on to the lettuce and I chopped it real um, small as well. I don't like to leave them big chunks. Put it in the bowl and then you're going to start with the cilantro. After the cilantro then you're going to put the tuna inside of it. Now that everything is chopped up, put together in the bowl, you're going to start mixing it. I'm not going to show the mixing because I don't have my tripod with me. After you're done mixing, you're going to put some mayonnaise inside of it. You could put whatever you want, what type of mayonnaise. You could put mustard too, but I just put mayonnaise. And then I'm going to add some pepper as well. The pepper gives it that extra like flavor and mix it all in. And there you go, you have your tuna. You're gonna put your two breads. And a trick that my sister taught me is to put cheese on it. I never would have thought of that, but I guess Subway, right? But yeah, that's what you're gonna do. And then you have your sandwich and enjoy. Hope you guys like this video, thumbs it up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't.